Hey, 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 it's Rona Dabbit. <laughs> hey, y'all. You're live with Brother Devin. And today, I'm coming to you with a blog. Hold on a minute. Let me get, let me get some water. All right, I want to, <clears throat> I want to apologize because when I came on here the first time, hold on, let me make sure my, okay, cool, cool. When I came on here the first time, I noticed that <laughs> my screen recording mic was not on. So, I want to apologize. So, I got to talk about everything all over again. Alright, so, um, welcome to those whom I've tagged. Let me tag it again. Oh, never, never mind. I got him. <clears throat> well, you know what? I think I want to invite this person. I mean, after all, I do love her. Okay. All right. So, in today's blog, we're talking about blacks, biracial beings, and the Red Star Organization. Alright, so, um, where, where I, where I want to start off is, back when I was a teenager, I was about 16 at the time, and during that time, um, I was doing an oratorical speech about the original Black Panther Party, which was started by Stokely Carmichael, who later became, um, yeah, which was started by Stokely Carmichael, who later became Kwame Torre. All right. <coughs> and then... Uh, after that came a co-founder by the name of Huey P. Newton, who is now our elder and ancestor. He's our revolutionary elder and ancestor. Um, now, back to me. I grew up in... Um, a multicultural environment where I went to school with uh, where, where, I, where I went to school with black kids white kids Hispanic children you know what I'm saying um <coughs> you 
Yeah. So, um, yeah, I, I, I was just a multicultural guy growing up. And, um, when I, and when I was 16, I was influenced by, when I was 16, I was influenced by the original Black Panther Party. And they, they woke me up politically. They woke me up through the African Liberation Movement, okay, via the Pan-African Movement. Um, and I, and I, I was with it for a while, strong, until I came out about certain things and they didn't really approve of that. <clears throat> but deep in my soul, I still felt co- connected to strong, militant, disciplinary black folks, right? But... It was because uh, Sister Sister Jesus, Sister Christine, she she tried to explain it to me, and yeah, she tried to, she tried to explain it to me that it's not about black versus white. However, deep in my soul and in my heart, I still felt pro black. You understand what I'm saying? But, but it was not until, it was not until our, 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 our revolutionary ancestor in the heavens, Dr. Huey P. Newton, sat me down in meditation and told me, he said, he said, young man, I understand your love for our people. But it is not about predominant blacks and whites anymore. This is about this is about humanity versus the global elected society. This 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 revolution this new revolution that's coming has to do with <coughs> it it has it has to do with <coughs> it has to do with the saving and the protection of humanity now i want to explain something to y'all and the thing that I would like to explain is this. The thing I want to explain is that um, I'm black, yes, and I and I love my people and I'm for them. I I always will be for y'all. My my whole occult lectures is pre predominantly black centered. Even my galactic awareness. Okay. However, <coughs> Doctor Huey P. Newton said that he he understand. My my hunger and my urgency to be a physically handicapped young black man who wants to be a, a, a revolutionary. But he said, in order for me to do this, I have to get both black and white people together. So, the first thing I asked Dr. Newton in the spirit realm was, I said, Dr. Newton, is it true that not only are you black, but is it true 
excuse me, is it true that you're also half white? And his response was yes. Now, with me on the other hand, I've I've seen predominantly black people all my all my life. And I also know that I have white people in my family. I I have white people in my family. However, however, if you as the white man or the white woman have not been around me to take care of me ever since I was a baby, you don't matter to me. Moreover, that that does not mean that does not mean that I hate all white people. And I'm a, and I'm going to tell you what I said the first time I recorded this. I said I don't hate all white people. I just hate <clears throat> I just hate the global e the global elite white folks whose dominant whose whose agenda is to <coughs> is to insinuate violence division prejudice and genocide amongst humanity let me say that again i don't hate all white people I hate the white folks whose agenda is to promote prejudice, division, and genocide amongst all of humanity. And when I say all, I literally mean all of humanity. Because the war, because they try to make this so-called racial war amongst us, and we we end up falling for it when our enemy, as a multicultural people, is the global elite. I mean, they're they're doing it right now through VCN, and I and I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say it because I can't talk about it here. All right. I love black people, and I love biracial people just as much. And I love poor predominantly white folks. Okay? I don't I don't have an issue with y'all. Even 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 the even the middle class white folks. I don't have an issue with y'all. But see I'm not I'm not a black panther. Let me say that again. <laughs> Dr. Hughes right here again. <laughs> I'm I'm not a Black Panther. I am a Red Star. My friend Segment Bassett is a Red Star. My friend Jesus <laughs> behind the scenes. In her own in her own way and right is a red star. But she she's handling things in the paranormal sense, in the supernatural sense, in the intergalactic sense. Okay? Now <clears throat> People, 
people are probably wondering, Brother Devin, what what's your whole thing about white white people being a being a guest in hip hop? I say, yeah, white white people are invited to hip hop. If it if it wasn't if it wasn't for the Beastie Boys, Eminem would not be rapping right now. Actually, yeah. Um, if it, if it, if it wasn't for the if it wasn't for the Beastie Boys and Vanilla Ice, Eminem would not be rapping right now. My only thing is the 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 Beastie Boys. Were the were the first rap and hip hop rap group to to uh dominate or or better yet I should say become a part of hip hop culture and I guess everybody back back then you know they were they were they were scared to come forward. And you know, form white rap groups because the only white rap groups we we knew were the Beastie Boys. I mean, I mean, of, of course, yeah, yeah. You had you had the you had the Red Hot Chili Peppers, and I and I'm, I'm glad I'm mentioning them. <laughs> but um. But yeah, a lot, a lot of, a lot, a lot of white people were scared to participate in 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 hip hop back then because us black folks in, in urban communities, we we were we were very hard on 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 white folks because we 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 uh we 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 remembered. How white people treated us uh, back in the historical times and in the cultural times. Now that nowadays the the only the only dances that are relatable to them is 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 the is the is the shimmy and you know disco music and and love shack. <laughs> and, and and all those other songs, you know, the 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 Beach Boys, etc. So, you know, when it when it came down to white to, to white folks trying to become a part of our culture, we we were always giving them the side eye and chastising them, telling them, "No, get out of here." You know, what I mean, you you don't belong to our culture, and in a sense, I I still kind of agree with that to an extent. Um, but I want to say that I'm 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 no longer Pan African. I left Pan Africanism over two years ago. However, I'm still for my people. I'm not I'm not leaving my people. But I I am opening myself up to the biracial aka interracial whatever culture. <clears throat> All right. I'm 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 cool with my interracial people. So um I want to I want to say this carefully that I don't offend too many white people I've I've seen um I've seen TV show I I've seen this one TV show called Deadly Women All right and I'm glad I watched 
this show carefully because it taught me that all of human, well, not all of it, but <laughs> most of humanity is messed up in the head because not only do you have crazy white women that want to kill people, you have crazy black women that want to kill and poison people. All right? Now, here's the thing. <clears throat> here's the thing with biracial and interracial folks. <clears throat> I... I, Devin Harris, in the near future, am st- I'm I'm starting with 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 the with the help of Sister Sekmet. I am starting a political self defense or organization slash political party called the Red Star Organization. All right? The the Red Stars Organization. I'm a I'm a I'm a Red Star for life even even after I die. My 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 energy won't be going nowhere. You understand? Alright, so, this is the thing, when we start, um, when we start the, uh, hold on, before I forget, um, I, I want to say that I, I, I understand that not all white women are evil. Okay? I I I used to I used to have romantic feelings for white women. Um I I have a friend that I met at Walmart. She's white. Okay? And she and she 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 didn't care as to whether I was black or not, she asked me for a hug because she loved my energy, and I, w- I was I was already in the in the midst of feeling sad anyway, so I n- I needed I needed a hug. I I didn't I didn't care I didn't care about the whole black and white thing, even though. In that in that time, I was having a pro black mind, and and this was the, around the same time, uh, our 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 elder in the spirit realm, Doctor Doctor Huey P Newton, told me that this new this new revolu this new revolution that's coming. Move move that out the way. I'm also screen recording, y'all. I'm sorry. But Doc, Dr. Huey, hey, 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 Jesus, <laughs> I, 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 I brought you etern- infinite love, infinite love, eternal love, eternal and infinite love to you, S- Sister Dragon, T- Team Atlantis, oh, 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 oh. All right, so <laughs> red red star power. By the way, um, okay, so back to what I was saying. Um, yeah, when I when I was when I was at the when I was at when when I was at the Walmart, and I I I met this I met this white lady. I didn't I didn't I didn't I didn't care whether 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 she was white. Cause you know, normally I, I'm like I don't. Normally I, I'm like 
in my in my in my mind, I'm like, I don't fuck with white people. Da 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 da. But but that but Dr. Huey P. Newton, Dr. Huey P. Newton in the spirit realm, he 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 said to me, young man, in order for you to be a revolutionary. And in order for revolution to work, you have to bring both black and white people together. And see, Sister Jesus tried to tell me this. And I, I'm, I ain't going to lie to you. I ain't going to lie to you. My, 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 my ass was arrogant. Be- because I felt I felt strongly about this whole pro black thing, and in a sense, I still do. I'm I'm not going to ignore the cries and the struggle of and the the struggles of black people. Shit, I'm I'm going through discrimination right now as a physically handicapped black man, motherfucker. Okay. <clears throat> you don't you don't you don't think you don't think people with physical disabilities and ha- have to deal with the thank thank you thank you thank you dra- thank you dragon <laughs> thank you dragon we all learn in TikTok Yes Yes Oh yeah and I'm putting you on my occult lectures channel also I hope you don't mind Mwah. and and uh happy solar Happy early solar return, by the way. Mwah, mwah, mwah. All right. Um. Yeah. I. I've. I've. I've dealt. I've dealt with. Um. I don't mind. Oh. Okay. Cool. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. I've. I've dealt with. Uh. The. Um. The discrimination. Too. Not. 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 Not just from, able-bodied folks. But. But people in wheelchairs too. <laughs> thank you, thank you for the early brother. No, 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 no pro, no problem, dragon. No problem. Yeah, but I, uh, but <laughs> I, I, I love God and Jesus. Me and her going to meet physically. That that's why I keep having like dreams about about this this supernatural being. You understand? So anyway. Yeah, I've 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 dealt with I've dealt with discrimination um um amongst not only able bodied people but my own as physically hit ha- as a physically handicapped black man. And this and this discrimination um came from Handicapped white people a couple of times, but 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 my but my discriminatory experiences came from my own, and they were in wheelchairs. Isn't that isn't that some shit? So, so so be so because of their their ignorance, I chose to separate and segregate myself from my own how however now n- now that I'm more conscious and subconscious about things i <coughs> i've i've ha- i have decided to come to physically handicapped people as a teacher and 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 say look I'm not here to get all close to you and be your friend. I'm I'm coming to you as a teacher to help you spiritually. I I give a fuck less if you don't like me. You understand me? I don't I don't I don't I don't care if you're in a wheelchair Walker, motherfucking crunches, cause I, cause I, I know what it was like to walk on a walker. It took me a whole four motherfucking years to, 
to to I, because I had to learn how to crawl and walk all over the fuck again. So, in, in instead of trying to be friendly and buddy buddy with a bunch of physically handicapped folks that are similar to me, I'm coming to them as a uh, paranormal, supernatural metaphysician and occult and intergalactic teacher. Let me say that again. I'm coming to them as a metaphysician, uh, 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 occult, uh, uh, occult, O-C-C-U-L-T, and intergalactic teacher. I, 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 like, I'm, I'm, I'm almost to the point in my heart chakra where I really don't want to get, I really don't want to get attached to a humanity that does not serve me anymore. That's real shit. I'm not I'm not all the way there yet because well, I don't I don't know. I, I'm 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 just not there yet. But I, but I'm I'm starting to let go of people that do not and will not serve me emotionally. Being like Jesus, serve me emotionally. She might not be able to care for me physically, although I, 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 I really want that because I, I know that I am a superhuman being. I'm, I'm not just a subconscious being. I'm a super subconscious being. Um, and I'm, I'm under contract. Uh, I don't know if I'm allowed to say what that contract is, but I'm 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 under contract, and it's not quite over yet for me. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm fine. Wait, let, wait. Let me get some water. Hold on. Yeah, but certain people. Certain beings in my life, I'm even choosing to let go of because, like, I don't, like, like, okay, I don't mind talking shit, but it has to, excuse me, excuse me, I don't mind, I don't mind, I don't mind, I don't mind trash talking, I don't mind talking shit, but it has to come it has to come to a place of comedy and love. Let me say that again. I don't. Let me say that again, because 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 I'm I'm from Philly, and in, and in, and you know in Philly, when 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 we get mad or want to get our point across, we 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 motherfucking bang tables, my nigga. So when it when when it comes to beings. All right. When, 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 when I deal with trash talkers, I want it to come from a place of comedy and love, not out of ignorance where shit gets personal. If if you're that type of indiv- individual, you are not super subconscious at all. And stay the fuck away from me, individually, and she's us too. She she don't need that shit. She don't want that shit. She she's not from here. She 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 has all that RNA genetics, uh, in 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 infused and downloaded inside of her. She don't need that. And if you fuck with her, you're fucking with me. Cause I cause. Shit, I don't mind it. I'll, 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 I'll run your ass over with this wheelchair, and and you don't want to get your get your bones crushed in this wheelchair. These 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 motherfucking things will fuck you up. Don't don't you don't you don't don't you don't you don't you mess with don't you mess with my intergalactic sister, okay? From 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 Atlantis. Okay, and and speaking 
of Atlantis spiritually. And I and I'm I'm glad I'm glad I had this basketball dream about Jesus. Because spiritually, my spirit told me, Devin, you're 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 about to move. You're about to transition from your own consciousness to a more Atlantean consciousness. So I now see the reason why <laughs> Jesus Christie. Mwah. I now see the reason why she is my intergalactic teacher. She she she's she's here to help me um bring bring myself back to that star seed frequency. How, however, I got to keep it all the way 100. My my earthly mother my physical mother, excuse me. My um my my earthly mother. She she ha she has the ancient comedic consciousness. She has the ancient comedic consciousness of my art in her. So, so if so if it was already in her and in my grandmother and in my great grandmother, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, then it's it's in me too. It's in me too. So what I'm saying is, I'm. I'm basically like an anchor. I got, I got my, yes, I do have my foot in uh, the 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 paranormal psychological realm, but but I but I I also have my foot in the black. And I I also have my foot in in the political and uh, 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 um, black and biracial realm. As as far as helping blacks and 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 biracial people politically through self defense, I've I've always been a self defense person. Um, I I love Batman, and and when I got tired of his ass, I was loving Superman and Spider Man. Why? Cause cause they cause they could fly. You know what I'm saying? Batman not so much. He he was a he was a he was a crime fighter. He he dealt with robbers and burglars. Um and 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 he 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 didn't he didn't naturally fly. He 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 had to have a certain item to help him, you know, f- fly past buildings and and shit. But I but I personally at at at, at Myers Superman cuz he he could fly and and whoop your motherfucking ass at the same time, okay? Um, so <laughs> back back to the uh p- political side of things. So I was having this this discussion with another sister of mine, sister Sekhmet by Sek. She also goes by the name of Het Heteruka. Okay? And um so with her assistance, she helped me to communicate with Huey Newton. And um I, I the honest truth is I I actually told Huey Newton that I want to prove to handicapped people as well as able-bodied people that handicapped people can bear arms um i i i i actually saw something where we we actually have the right as physically handicapped people um to bear arms uh i f- i forgot the i forgot the name of the movement because not not only do they help um people who are uh, paralyzed, but they also help people like myself who are mobile. See, 
um, I'm I'm able to move my body. I just can't walk. So so yes, I am able to carry two guns. Okay. Yes, I I I am able to carry two guns. I I know how to shoot them. Um, both both my both my both my both my both my both my biological father and my uncle who passed away um happy ascension to my un- uncle Richard Wiggins they they were both soldiers in the in the uh the military um uh, the uh I think it was the the Korean War the um the the war in Co- Co- the war in Korea and um and also um they they were they were invited to area 51 so both my uncle and my biological father they 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 know about extraterrestrials they 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 know about the grays etc right um so 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 again now, as far as my biological father is concerned, I n- I know I need to learn to forgive him, but right now, personally and, and individually, I'm not I'm not ready to. But but you know, as as far as him serving the country, I ha- I have no choice but to respect that. Even though even though he he's no longer in the military, all 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 he wants to do is bike, and you know ride motorcycles. I I ha- I have no choice but to respect. I I have no choice but to respect my my biological father for 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 his participation in the U.S. military. I I, I also have um uh, ma- Marines, um more more soldiers, uh l- lieutenants. I don't. I don't have any generals in my family. I. I wish I. I wish I. I wish I met them. Um. But. But. Uh. We. We got. We got generals. I, I. I'm sorry. We got. We got. We. We got lieutenants and we got soldiers in my family. Um. So. 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 So that. So that pushed me, to kind of push a. Black Panther like mindset within myself. Now, right now, I'm not a Black Panther, and Dr. Huey P. Newton doesn't want me to be a Black Panther. He wants me to be a Red Star. Okay? And, um, I'm, now, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to do an entire p- political history lecture i I'll, I'll do that again sometime in in the near future because right now i'm 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 actually studying my whole red star organization psychology i'm 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 learning about myself not not just as a person um but but as a uh political leader uh a a a, a revolutionary um I'm uh, a uh, I'm I'm a musician <laughs> metaphysician a, a cult teacher and practitioner and just like Jesus okay so 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 there's a lot of things about me that I'm still learning before I go ahead and share with the with the world and one of the books I actually shared on Facebook is called the 13 things mentally strong people don't do by Amy Morin. The book is by Amy Morin. Hold on. The 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 book is by Amy Morin. And um it's it, it's it's with her psychology and psychiatry uh, that that I'm 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 practicing how to gain my mental strength back. I don't I I I can't be, uh, I can't be a, um, I can't be both a spiritual leader and political leader if I don't have any mental strength. You understand what I'm saying? 
I mean, it just it, it just wouldn't make sense. So, um, I want to say this. It's because it's hello Terry Bright. It's because of Dr. Huey P. Newton, who is also not only black, but he's half white. It's because of him. He told me that with, he said, with my help, we're going to start a new revolutionary movement that that not only um, deals with blacks, because yes, all, although it may be predominantly black, uh, people who are uh, inter- interracial or, or go by the so-called label of biracial, um, they, they are allowed in this movement. So, if, so if you yourself are biracial and are a part of a biracial family, Yes, you can join the Red Star movement. Okay? Now I'm 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 just the I'm I'm just the 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 the, the, the messenger and and the uh and the uh the, the co founder of this of this Red Star organization. Well re- well really I'm I'm the f- I'm I'm the founder of it, but um I I I also have a couple of other people with me as well. And then I have a female, I hope she's still on here, uh Sister Christine. She 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 I, I can tell she's gonna be watching my movement from the 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 astral and if it's meant for us to meet physically and I'm and I'm still doing my political thing by that time then hey it is what it is so and so be it so so mote it be and so it is right um so not only is this movement for um <clears throat> blacks and and you know f- physically handicapped people but it but it's but it's also for 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 those of you um who 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 are born and raised in interracial families so yes both blacks and interracial people can join this self defense party you 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 do have a place in in our movement however if you are predominantly white and you hate black people or uh interracial people you can you cannot be a part of our organization, and, and as a matter of fact, that that is divine order from Doctor Huey P. Newton, because okay, what he what he what he stated was, blacks and biracial people can join the organization, but if you are predominantly white and you are prejudiced you cannot be a part of the organization i'm sorry those were his his instructions when i when i was in meditation with him you know what i mean because i i hate i hate to say it but i kind of i kind of pick up after my biological father you know what i'm saying but you know i i want to be i want to be pro I want. I want to be pro. I want to be pro humanity, because the whole pro black thing. I feel that that is now a personal thing. It's a. It's a personal political thing. It's not. It's. It's not a global thing. So on. On a. On a both. Uh, personal, and global per perception, I'm dealing with the Red Star movement. I don't I don't I don't I don't care about the new Black Panther Party. That's that's dead. And 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 Huey P. Newton uh told me earlier when when I was on live but my my mic wasn't on. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh 
and Dr. Huey P. Newton said the 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 new the new Black Panther Party that is dead. That is dead. Because you 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 had you had too many people get getting involved in that. And I'm feeling him him say it was a it was a it was a bunch of coonery going on. Coonery and, and, and buffoonery. But he says with me, see, I'm phys- I, I'm physically handicapped and I have an even greater advantage than those motherfuckers to bring people together. Just as just as just as much as black folks. Because again, like I said in the beginning of this live stream, I can't ignore the cries of my people. However, I'm also aware that I can't help every black man and black woman in the in the hood and suburbs. Because you have people that um I might I might be using this word wrong, but you have you have um black people that move out of the hood and you know move in to the suburbs. I, I I live in the burbs with with my with my mom and pops. Do I do I like it? I'm gonna be honest with you. No. <laughs> I I really wish I was raised a a, a whole hood nigga. I mean in in a, in a sense I, I still am, you know, because my my mama and them, you know, they they, they gave me hip hop culture. So I I got my hood pass through hip hop culture, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, Doctor Dr. Newton said, "Said that that's right. That's that's right. That's a fact. I I got I got I got my I got my hood pass through 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 hip hop, boom bap, and and you know backpack culture. You know what I mean with with uh with 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 Quasimodo and all them." Um, bro, bro, brother, brother Crondon, and uh, brother Ali, who are um, black albinos. Doctor Dr. Newton says they're 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 allowed in the 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 organization as well. We 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 need we need as much help as we can get. We need we need we need, we need as much help as we can get. Now the other thing I want to mention is there there will there will not be a there will not be a social media if 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 we if we have if we have something that's social media like it will be off the grid of Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, no no Snapchat, no Instagram, fuck all that shit. We we we're going to have our own foundational space. We don't we don't we don't need we don't need Facebook and YouTube tracking us down. Now we now we might use those uh, we we might use those outlets to uh, pr- promote the um, the 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 new age political self defense party, but. It is it's it's gonna be difficult for the powers that be to track us down because we're we're going to be uh covert and when I say covert it's going to be from it's going to be from the sense of um peekabooing. It's like we're gonna we're gonna be here and then we're gonna be hiding the next. You know, we're going we're gonna be up one minute and then we're gonna be underground the next because you know that that's how you know that's how the uh, uh um that's how that's how that's how that's how snick got shut down back in back in the 60s early 70s that's how snick got shut down um be, because there was there was too much pu- publicity and yeah there was too much pu- publicity going on and 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 a, a, a lot of a lot of uh, uh uh I'm I'm feeling Dr. Huey Newton's consciousness again. A lot of um, a lot of 
uh, difference of opinion going on. A lot of a lot of hypocrisy and snitching going on. We're not gonna have that w- within the Red Star movement because, see, my mind as a leader and whoever whoever's watching this, please listen. Please listen. Um, my mind as a leader, I don't want, like, just because I'm a leader, I, I should not be the only one with ideas. My, my, uh, my, uh, my, my, my students, uh, or, or better yet, I should say the, the, the rest of my organizers. And staff of this Red Star movement should have ideas too, and and they and they and they have to be ideas that we can both m- mentally and um, physically and politically a- agree on, because I don't I don't want no swing swing of boats mentally where where. Where 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 one I where one idea is swaying this way, and then the other idea is swaying that way. No, nah, man. Uh, uh-uh. we we can't we can't we can't have that. We gotta be on 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 on, on one accord. I I wish I had I wish I had sister Kathleen Cleaver still at, still as my friend on Facebook. I I wish I did, but you know. Back 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 then, I was like super duper pro black at the time, and she she didn't like that. But see, at the time, she she was one of the the spokes the spokesperson for the original Black Panther Party back in the late sixties, early seventies. Yes, Doctor Newton says that's right. He 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 know he he, he knows I, I know my history a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So I w- I wish I had the the chance to tell her. Look, I'm I'm sorry if the things I was posting on Facebook in front of you before made you feel uncomfortable to the point where you wanted to block me and never as- associate with me again. But I I, w- I want to let you know that I've changed, and I like I I love. Huey P. Newton, because, you know, Sister Jesus tried to change me before. I, w- I was arrogant. I was hard-headed. I did not want to listen to that shit. I, I had a pro-black mind knowing that that shit was not going to work because not, 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 all, not, all, not all black people, <laughs> thank you for the love, whoever that is, um, put, 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 put your name in the comments. Um, you know, back, 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 back then when I was pro-black, I, I was, I, I, I go front, a, a, a nigga was hard-headed, a nigga was hard-headed, and the, and the only, the only being that could make me come to my senses was Huey P. Newton, because she, because she just tried. I didn't, I, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't give a fuck. I didn't listen. She, she just tried to tell me it's not about black and white. And the, and the only person, the only, the only supernatural being that could get through to me was, was our ancestor and our elder, um, uh, uh, of the, the former coalition of the Black Panther Party in the 60s, early 70s was early 70s was Dr. Huey P. Newton. He was he was the only being in the spirit realm to 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 get through to me. Gre- greetings, Terrence. How are you, my brother? Red, red, red star power. Red star power. And I'm I'm gonna be speaking on on this on this subject again in the near future. But but be, but before but before I can really talk about it, I I have to read up on it. I I actually have I actually have the book about the um about the um the the development and mission statement 
of the Red Star organization, which is a self-defense uh, political and an anarchy self-defense party. Okay? All right? So, um, back to what I was saying about S Sister Kathleen Cleaver. Um, Sister Kathleen Cleaver, 